Hey guys, Kyle Turner here at the Mega Outdoors. I'm going to show you guys how we clean these squirrels. First thing we do is we come in right by the butthole, make a slit down his back. Go through tailbone and kind of bring that hide down on the back of his legs like how you'd do if you were skinning a deer. So it looks something sort of like that. Now once you get them, once you get this cut down his back, cut through the tail and then uh, skin around the backs of his legs a little bit on both sides, you're going to take your foot and you're going to put it on his tail. Then you're going to pull up, grab his, both his back legs and pull up. And that is skin three quarters of him. The only thing you'll have left is his back legs with fur on it. So reach down, grab his front legs, pull it out of the skin. Now after you get his skin pulled down, and you reach down and you pull his legs out of his front leg skin, I come around, I grab him up by the torso, and I work his back leg skin off, off. And at that point, I take him, I got this board here, with two nails on it, I stick his back legs through the nails. All right, now when you get him hung up on your board, take a pair of uh, electrical dikes, do each one of his ankles, but don't go all the way through. You'll be able to cut that with your knife in a minute. I guess you could go through on the front if you wanted, if your dikes are sharp enough, but mine aren't. Now get your knife, come up here on these front legs, run your knife right down next to his ribs, so you'll come through the uh, sock there on the front arm, spin him around, do the same thing, come in tight to the body. You'll come through and hit that socket. If you hit that socket, the arms come off real easy. All right, now come up here. Take your knife, run it through the pelvis bone. Clean all the junk out, and then run your knife right down next to his back. And you'll work this these guts down this rib cage area. Take your dikes, cut it off there. Now all your guts and whatnot are gone. Take your knife again, cut the ankle off right where you diked it, run your knife down, right next to the pelvis bone again. If you come in tight enough and feel with your knife blade, you'll hit that uh, socket there. And it'll come off real easy. Come over here, do the same thing. Come in tight. There you have it. You got a quartered out plus his back. Pretty easy way. If you do it a few times, you get pretty good at it.